Hi, kitty cats. I know it's been a while. I had an nasty ear infection. So I took a couple extra days to just try and deal with that. But anyways, I've got some neat things for you today. I don't think I blended that out as well on this side. What do you think? Huh? Okay, anyways. So, I'm gonna do a little first impressions review. Sorry, I thought I heard something. <laughs> I'm gonna do a little first impressions review of some of the latest Zany Laney scents. I have two of them here. And I'm gonna tell you what I think of them. And uh, don't forget to share, subscribe, give this video a thumbs up if you like it, and you know, hit that bell twice if you want. So to today, see. like I said, we have two of these, and the theme this month was '80s. So she did like some '80s movie themes kind of thing. So we have one called Great Scott, which I'm sure you know what that is. If you don't. We'll just play it. But it's Back to the Future. And we have another one called Rich Stuff, which is uh, Goonies. So I'm going to smell the Rich Stuff first. I've actually already smelled them. But <laughs> this one is very, it's very peachy. It's peach, ginger, and paprika. And you can really, the peach is very, very strong. But there's some slight spiciness from the ginger. I don't really smell paprika, but to be honest, I don't know what paprika smells like. I know that Hungarian paprika smells smoky, but regular paprika doesn't... I've never noticed it having a scent. Um, I cook with it, but I never noticed it having a scent. So I'm not sure what paprika is supposed to smell like, but this smells really really good so if you like peach scents like i do i like peachy stuff um this is really good it smells so good i love it and then we have the great scott one which is mr pepper and fresh grass which mr pepper i think is supposed to smell like dr pepper which is exactly what it smells like. I don't smell the fresh grass. It, I think it's an undertone of fresh grass. It's Dr. Pepper, Mr. Pepper, whatever you want to call it. It's super, super strong. And I actually really can't wait to melt this. It's going to be... I'm not going to melt it today. I'm like pulling it out. You can see it comes out in like a little block like that. And you can like cut it in half if you want to. Um, I do when I'm using my smaller, um, wax melter that's in the bathroom, but my big wax melter, I just put this whole chunk in because, I, um, if I don't, I end up not being able to smell it because it's a big, big space in my, my living room. So you do whatever you want to use the whole thing, cut it in half, cut it in quarters, Whatever works for you. This smells really good. I actually really love Dr. Pepper soda. So. And it smells just like that. So. Yay. I actually don't drink Dr. Pepper that often anymore. Because when I do, I start craving it pretty easily. I swear there must be some sort of addictive thing in it. Because. If I drink it, I start wanting to drink it all the time. Um, I know a lot of people who are Dr. Pepper addicts, and this is something that will probably make you want to go out and buy some Dr. Pepper and drink it. It really, really smells good. It smells just like it. It's really neat. It's really interesting when they get a scent like that. I, I'm really impressed to get the scent of a soda so perfectly. It's pretty amazing to me. So anyways, if you want to go check out Zany Laney, the link will be down below in the information. 
and you can use my discount code, which is badkitty10, and that will be down there in the information too, and that will get you 10% off your whole order. They also have body sprays, and they have other things too. They have art, um, and I even think they have sneakers now, like, that are, have the art, you know, on them, and I'm not sure, I think that's, there's gonna be some other stuff in the future from what I understand, but you know, um, and if you wanna get, if there's any certain wax melts scents that are your favorite, I suggest getting them now because I think after July, they won't be making the wax melts anymore. Um, they'll be going strictly with like, like body sprays and I think there are gonna be some other things like um, lotion or butter or something like that. So if you have a specific scent that you like, get them now because they won't be making the wax anymore. Which I know, sad, but that's just the way it is. They had to do it. Um, let me think for a minute. <laughs> I'm a little out of breath. So yeah, those are the wax melts. And uh, you can also get all these in body spray. And the body sprays also can be used as other things. I know people who use them to spray in their cars. Um, I've used them before to spray on my linens to give it like a fresh scent. And it stays on the linens a good amount of time. It's really amazing. Um, otherwise than that, I think that's everything I wanna go on. Oh, and the wax melts. These are made with soy wax. There's no like dyes or anything in them. So they're very, very like non-harmful. So, yay. And that's it for now. I'm sorry, like once again, I'm gonna say I'm sorry I haven't been around, but I have been dealing with an ear infection and we'll be seeing some more films this week. Okay, bye-bye kitty cats. Don't forget. Be kind, even when you want to slap them in the face.